So here we have two 50 watt panels wired in series into the controller here, which is the MPPT controller. And then into that is the connected meter, which will tell us what's going on. And all of the battery side is connected to this car, which has a fully charged battery, but I can switch the lights on and off to put a load onto the battery. Now put the headlights of the car on, which put the battery under load. It's pulling now, I guess, about 10 amps. And you can see the voltage has gone down to 12.2 volts. And now, we'll charge, now we'll connect the solar panels. So now the two solar panels are connected in series and the MPPT controller is trying to search for the maximum power point of the solar panels and it's decided it's going to run them at 33.6 volts. You can see it moving slightly as it tries different settings to see where the maximum power is. So on the car battery side it's now up to 12.8 volts and charging at 5.1 amps. So what we have is the panels running at 32 volts-ish and the car battery charging at 5.1 amps at 12.8 volts. So the system has been on charge now for about half an hour and without the load on the battery the voltage has steadily increased as the charger pushes towards its maximum boost voltage which is around 14.4 volts which it just hit. So the charging side of the controller will push this battery at 14.4 volts for about two hours before it brings it back down to float voltage of 13.8. So this is about, for this time of day, it's about 4.30 in the afternoon. It's putting out 14.4 times 4.5 amps. That's how many watts it's using. That's about as good as we're going to get today.